Hey guys, welcome back to Heavy Rain Part Whatever. I don't know then, you know. But we're uh, back again, and we're with Ethan, and he's uh, acting kind of sad. Sad boy. Oh, it's a Maddie Moo. <clears throat> I like her in this outfit. Ethan, are you all right? I... I killed a man. <laughs> I had no choice. Damn. I had no choice. You're not the origami killer, Ethan. You're not responsible for those murders. Yep. I can prove it. That changes nothing. Saving Sean is all that matters now. Oh. Oh! Yes! Yes! Kiss! Of course! Oh. Strange kiss. Oh. Oh. Going for it. Going for it. Going for it, Ethan. Alright, alright, alright. This is gameplay. This is actual gameplay. I am genuinely excited. Is it just kissing? Oh, hell yeah. Make that move, boy. R1. Oh. 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 They taking off. They stripping. They stripping. They stripping. They stripping. This is gameplay. Still looks like it's attached to his body. Oh, Ethan got the moves. He might, he may have learned from Scott Shelby. What was that? Is he, is she just eating air? What's going on? I think they need to work on their game. Oh, 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 they gonna have babies. I think they're gonna have babies, guys. Oh! Oh no! Oh no, 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 no! No, I can't see Maddie. Maddie! Oh no! Oh, whoa! 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 Oh. God. I'm gonna have to censor this out, huh? Come on. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Come on, this is what I couldn't do in the car. Come on. There we go. Okay, we got it. Uh, okay, there's no nipples. I didn't see any. Uh, he's just covering it up. That's good. Oh, I saw one. I see him. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Well, uh, I know I'm going to have to censor this a lot. <laughs> really, guys, the start of the episode. The start of the episode. This is what this is this is what gameplay is. Oh. I don't know how they got their pants off, but you know. Uh, play that was just they're playing sad music over it too. Aw. Well let's be gentle. Be gentle with the baby. Huh? He has no finger. <laughs> uh, oh, shoot. Come on. Got this. There you go. Skills. How she's doing. Oh, okay. Well, you're just looking at her. Let's get up. 
continue our day. Should we get dressed? Oh, there's nothing. Damn it. No beer. Uh, where's my clothes? Oh. Okay, well. That was of no purpose. Maybe there's something. I can take a shower or something. Look all presentable for my Maddie Moo. Well, Ethan got some puss. There's actually p some good, good, uh, yeah. <clears throat> good action. Good man, good man. Yeah, feel refreshed. You got a new lady. You got a new lady friend. You can't do that. Can you pee? Can't pee. Can't do that. Can't do that. Beautiful. Mm. Oh, beautiful. It's like spaghetti. Oh, there's my clothes. God, it looks like it's a part of his skin. Does he ever, does he only have those clothes? Or? All right, I think this is the last one. This may be the last one. The last letters, yep, 9961 Rainbow Lane. Oh, wait. She's the only person I can trust. But now I have to be alone to do what I have to do. Only one more origami figure. Then I find my son. Things might have worked out between us if circumstances had been different. I've already wasted too much time. I've got to get through this last trial. Okay. She's still asleep. No goodbyes, no explanations. I'll just leave before she wakes up. Oh. She's been following. There's only four pictures, though. All this time, and I had no idea. Ethan, what's the matter? I thought I meant something to you. Listen, I... You're a pretty good nurse for a fucking journalist! <gasps> Ethan, I, I, I wanted to tell you, but... What kind of article were you gonna write? My life with a serial killer? No, no, no. How I caught the origami killer. <sighs> Maybe you'll get a book deal. I hope it went fucking Come working. on, Ethan. It's okay. Ethan, it's not what you think. I. No. You lied to me, Madison. All this time you fucking lied to me. I thought you wanted to help me, but you're only thinking of writing a fucking book? Damn. It's true. I'm a journalist. And I knew that you were the father of the boy who had disappeared, and... And I wanted to cover the story. But then I saw what you were going through to save your son. And... And I understood how much you love him. I wanted to tell you the truth, but I couldn't. I was afraid that you... That you... May not believe me. I was afraid that you'd ask me to go. All I want is for you to find your son alive. 
And when it's all over, I want to be with you. Oh. Forgive. Forgive her. I'm sorry, Ethan. I'm so sorry. That's my man. You did the right thing. You did the right thing. You're leaving, aren't you? It's the last origami figure. The last letters, then I'll know where Sean is. Take care, Ethan. I can't lose you now. Damn. She all uh, she all about Ethan right now. My boy, my boy got a lady. He got wifey. He found wifey. He found the love, love of his life. There. Mm. I'm gonna go find something to eat. Wait for me. I'll, I'll be back in ten minutes. Okay. Where am I going? Gotta go down. Ethan, Ethan, Ethan. What a man. What a god. Mm -hmm. Gonna get something to eat. Might as well eat that boot. No, it's fine. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Oh, that creepy dude. Oh, what? Uh... <clears throat> We're gonna Cops. Have to leave. They're looking for Ethan. It looks like a raid. Let's go get the phone. Let's hurry. What's going on? Isn't this great? Like being in a TV show. Who'd have thought it? The origami killer renting a room here. He registered under a false name, but I recognized his face. No, you didn't, you jack. Come on, what was the damn number? 207? Come on, come on! <gasps> it was 207! The cops, they're in the motel. You've got to get out of here. Oh shit. For Sean, for Sean. Who's this guy? Whoa. Oh, sorry, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, okay, gotta be, gotta be on. This way. Go that way. Uh, down. Uh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, he had to go up. Okay. Square, 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 square. Ow. Don't. Don't move. Oh hell no. Hell no. Hell no. I escaped. They better not. I press square. That's bull. Am I able to... Mm. I'm going to see if I can. 
Oh, okay. Well, I got an achievement for it, so. I think I'm not, it's not like I'm dead or anything. All right, let's, let's give it a chance. I'm not here to judge you, Ethan. I'm trying to save the life okay. of your son. We still have time, but it's running out. Help me, Ethan. Tell me what you know. I'm sure you had your reasons for doing what you did. Hmm. You didn't think you were doing any harm. You just wanted the pain to go away. I'll help explain all that to the judge. Don't let Sean die. Tell us what you know, and we can still save him. You've lost, Ethan. What will you gain with one more victim? Huh? Come on, Ethan. Look at these, Ethan. Look at these. Eight photographs. Eight lives taken. Drowned in the goddamn rain. Recognize this one, huh? That's your son, Ethan. That's Sean. That's he is still up. alive. Talk to me, <clears throat> Ethan. Say something. Come on, Ethan. I kidnapped my son. But I can't remember what happened. I don't know where he is. But the only way to find him is to let me out of here. I'm the only person who can save him. You don't remember anything, but you think you're the origami killer. I'm sorry, Ethan, but you're gonna have to do a lot better than that if you want me to believe you. I love my son. I love my son. If you keep me here, Sean is going to die. Time's running out, Ethan. And frankly, I don't care why you did it. The only thing I want to know is where you've hidden Sean. I don't know. I would already have saved him if I knew where he was. Okay. This is your last chance, Ethan. And this time, I suggest you think carefully before... <coughs> He's about to hit him. I'm about... Where I'm just like... I'm is... ready to... Sean. I'm like right here. I'm ready to. S I told you I don't I'm ready. know. I'm ready. Ah! Hey, get off, Ethan. Come on, asshole. I've been waiting for this for a long time. Come on, come on, there, pussy. Let's see what you got. Oh, yeah? Let's see what I got. Oh! Give me that. Come here. Wanna play games, asshole? Come on. Let's play a little game. You're out of your mind, Blake. This is gonna cost you your badge. You better get the hell out of here, Norman. Before I give in to the temptation to paint the walls with your fucking brains. You're freaking crazy. That is not the way it's gonna go. I'm gonna tell the whole story to Captain Perry. Fuck! That asshole has gone too far this time. Where the fuck is the cat? That bastard is gonna beat a confession out of Mars. He just wants a culprit, even if it's the wrong guy. I don't even know where the hell the guy is. I literally just walked in. Oh, sir. Oh, okay. 
Blake is trying to beat a confession out of Ethan Mars. You've got to do something! Which is more important, Norman? Finding little Sean Mars or sparing that lowlife a few bruises? You can't make omelets without breaking a few eggs. God damn! Ethan Mars is innocent! We've got to get back to looking for Sean if we're to have any chance of finding him alive! This case has worn you out, Norman. You need some time off to think it through. Damn, nobody's listening. Don't take a trip. Don't take a trip. No, I, I can't just stand by and watch. I'm gonna help Mars get out of here. I gotta find some way to get Ethan Mars out of here. Even if there's only a one in a thousand chance he's telling the truth, he may still be able to save his son. Okay. It's none of my business. If Perry and Blake think Mars is the killer, what can I do about it? Did Mars confess? No, not yet. He lost consciousness. We'll give him a break and then we'll get back to him. He must be My gut feeling is thought. that Mars is innocent and I gotta get him out of here. Tough or not, he'll crack. They all do. In any case, congratulations, Lieutenant. You've done a fine job. No, he did. I've called a press conference. Gonna kick off in one hour. I expect it'll be quite an event. Has he confessed? <laughs> not yet. I see. Leave us alone. I... Uh, Lieutenant Blake said to... Please, leave us alone. Damn right. Listen to Jaden. Right. Uh, I'll be at the door if you need anything. <gasps> Christ. Are you all right, Ethan? Ah. <sighs> 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 I gotta get out of here. I've gotta save my son. Let's see what I can do. I uh, get him out. I'm gonna find a way to get you out of here, Ethan. Stay put. I'll be back. All right. All right. Probably a key somewhere. He's like, nah, I don't want to go in there. Okay, that's not this. Can you move? Thank you. my office shit what am I doing helping a suspect to escape that'll cost me my badge and earn me a 10-year stretch should be able to get him out of here without being noticed I need keys though Hard to, I can't, I don't, I don't know exactly because they're not really showing me. I don't go in there. Obviously, I don't want to go in there. Ooh. 
Ooh, interrogation room. Okay. Is there keys of some sort? Okay. Gary, you can take a break. I'll keep an eye on him. You sure? Actually, I was busting for a piss. If you need to adjust his handcuffs, the keys are on my desk. On his desk, okay. First, get rid of the cuffs. On his desk, on his desk. Where's Gary's desk? He's on his desk. Gary, where's your desk? Huh? Yep, yeah, no one saw the thing. Alright. That was lucky. I didn't I didn't actually know where it was. That's it. You're free. Here, put this on. They're having a break. If you're quick, you'll be able to slip out without being noticed. Go, go, go. Head straight to the exit. Don't stop, don't talk, don't even think. Just walk. I don't know what to say. I... Just say you're gonna save your son. Save your son. <clears throat> nice. All right, we did it. Scott Shelby, haven't seen you in a while. Wise guy. All right, new achievement. Man. This game, it has to be, it has to be John Shepard's brother portraying as John, uh, as John Shepard. Where the hell was the lock? Lord? I'm sorry, Scott. You should have listened to me, Mr. Shelby. I told you to drop the investigation. What? Your son is a serial killer. How many people does he have to kill before you turn him in? Gordy has his faults, but he's still my son. You have no children, Mr. Shelby. You can't possibly understand. You leave me no choice. Your investigation is over. No. For good. Come on. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's underwater. Lauren, Not another no. car thing. Not yeah. another car thing. Uh, shit. Shit. Lauren! Lauren, wake up! Lauren! Come on. God damn it. No one. No, no, no. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. R1. R1. L1. Got it. Goddamn fool. Nothing's gonna work if I don't switch on that ignition.
That's not what I wanted to do. Alright, let's go. We gotta get out. Yeah. Yeah. One for Obama. Oh, I thought he just left her. Haha. <laughs> Alright, good. I was gonna take up swimming again. This isn't exactly what I had in mind. <laughs> you got a car back at your place? Mine's obviously pretty fucked up. <laughs> yeah, sure. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go settle a few scores. Come on, I'll take you home. I'll lock your doors and windows and don't let anybody in but me. Okay? Be careful, Scott. I don't wanna lose you. I don't wanna lose you. Maddie Moo version 2? Oh god. Scott Shelby part two. The lighting looks really nice. It's a nice new setup area I got going on for myself. Swimming instructor, achievement unlocked. Nice. Oh damn. <laughs> he looked angry. Oh damn. Scott Shelby mad. <clears throat> Scott shall be pissed. He's mad. Oh, hell yeah. It's okay. Well, Matty Boo, back at it again, I see. I like their faces. Geriatrics. 4.9 inches, holy cow, that's a record. I'm looking for Ann Shepard's room. Please sign the visitor's book. Why do I got signs on? Are you a member of the family? Yeah, you could say that. Oh, she'll be pleased to have a visitor. No one ever comes to see her. With the Alzheimer's, she has trouble remembering things, but it'll still please her, you know. It's room 19 at the end of the corridor. Okay. Thank you. <clears throat> Fruity things. Oh, 
Uh, eight. Well, I hope Scott Shelby's okay. He took a couple bullet wounds. Okay. Can I grab it? No? Okay. I, I thought bringing flowers to the old lady would be nice, but... Seventeen, eighteen. Oh, okay. That's the wrong way. Wait a minute, but she said, uh, okay. Is it this one? Oh, there's a room right there. That's 20. All right, 19. Nice. Hello, Mrs. Shepard. Hello, Mrs. Shepard. Is it time for my pills already? No. It's no, not. Mrs. Shepard, I... They're never on time with my pills. I don't know what they do here. The other hospital, they were always on time. But here... My name is Madison Page. I'm a journalist. I'd like to ask you some questions about your son. I don't like this hospital. The food isn't very good, you know. Yep. It's not that good. You had a son named John, and John had a twin brother. Do you have my pills? It's time for my pills. I gotta get her damn pills. Do you remember John? My Johnny. He is a good little boy, you know. I know what happened at Carnaby Square. Do you remember? Carnaby Square. I think I used to live there a long time ago. We didn't have much money at the time, you know. We had to make do with very little. Hmm. Your other son, Mrs. Shepard, John's twin brother. What was his name? What other son? I have no other son. I never had any children. Yeah, you did. You just can't remember. Try to remember, Mrs. Shepard. John's twin brother was placed with a foster family after the accident. What was the name of the foster family? I asked them for a television, you know. They said I didn't have enough God money. God damn. It's a pity. I'm fond of television. Poor old lady. I'm really scared of Alzheimer's. I think your son is in trouble, Mrs. Shepard. He's done some terrible anything. things. I need to find him. Do you understand? Terrible things you're telling me. He never came to see me. Can you believe it? In ten years, never. No one forgets their mother, do they? Mrs. Shepard, your son may be linked to a series of murders. Perhaps you have some information that could help the investigation. Are you a new nurse? Where, Where are my pills? pills? You, you were on an origami boat. Wait a second. I see something. Get it. No, 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 no. No, Maddie Moo. We're gonna make an origami. Get the paper. We're gonna make this crane. Oh, do the crane. Okay. And down. And square and oh, that was bad. Oh, wait, no. Did I make it? I made it. Hey, I love origami. But that's not my favorite one. Which one's your favorite one? No. That is not what I wanted. Okay. 
Is it a hummingbird? Let's try that. Let's try this one. Circle. Down. Triangle. Side. L1. Side. Hummingbird? How about this? I love origami. Damn it. But that's not my favorite Which one. Which one is your favorite one? Why are you talking like that? Alright, let's look around. Huh. Are these your children, Mrs. Shepard? John and his brother? Is that them? They're good little boys. Their father never looked after them. Always drinking. They didn't have an easy life, you know. Yep. I could tell. Who's the brother? That's really getting to me. That's nothing. You don't seem to get many flowers, Mrs. Shepard. No, but I love them. Oh, she loves flowers. My son knows that I love flowers. I know he'll bring me some. Well, I uh, hate to break the news. Okay, maybe there's a flower on Let's see. If I can stop moving. No, that's a doggy. The froggy. Let's, let's try this. Please don't say it. I love origami. But that's not my favorite one. Alright, it might be the doggy. Most likely the dog. Okay, let's do that one. <clears throat> Triangle. Down. Oh, wait. Down. L1. Side. Square. Oh no. Harigami. Origami. 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 Origami, 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 origami. R1, side. Alright, please. Oh, you know how to do these little dogs, too. Knew it! My Fourth children time. loved origami. I taught them how to do it. Of course you did. John loved the little dogs. He always wanted to call them Max. Max, Max, Max. All dogs with the same name. I was wasting my time telling him they couldn't all have the same name. But he always wanted his paper dogs Max. It's funny, isn't it? It'd take days, if not longer, to find the name of the family that adopted her son. Sean Mars would be dead by then. Her memory is coming back. Don't stop now. Just, just remember. This woman might be the origami killer's mother. Must be some way to get her to remember. Did you make these origami figures? My little paper animals. They played with them for hours. <coughs> I showed my boys how to make them, you know. Yes, your boys, Mrs. Shepard. John and what was your other son's name again? My other son? I only had one son. My little Johnny. Now you have two. If we can figure it out together. Maybe I'll go get those flowers. It's probably those flowers outside. Or is there anything in here? 
what will give me a chance. Madam Madison, I don't need to see your beautiful face right now. Alright, we need to turn around. Alright, we're gonna go get we're gonna get those flowers. I think it's those flowers. I'll be right back, Miss Shepherd. Um okay, I think it's the flower. I think that's what's gonna trigger it, those flowers I saw earlier. These ones. I knew it. I knew it. It had, yeah. Alright, we're going. See, she's the only one who can. Does Mrs. Shepard ever talk about her past? It's not all very clear to her now. Sometimes she'll remember the oddest things, though. I suppose if she sees something that reminds her of her past. I'm looking for her other son. He was adopted. I mean, he, he's probably changed his name. Is there any official documentation on Mrs. Shepard? No, there's nothing really. Nothing about her family. I guess if her son was adopted, then she's the only one who could tell you about that. Does she get many visitors? She's been here for 10 years and you're the first. Wow. Sometimes, if you show her things, it seems to trigger a memory from her past. You might get it to remember. Okay. Thanks for the advice. We'll do that. I didn't need to talk to you, because I kind of knew that. Whoa! Okay, the music just cut out. And it's back again. Uh, we should go this way. There you what go. a lovely orchid. My sons loved orchids. We used to grow them in the back. When John died, I laid orchids on his grave. I cried when they told me. I'd already lost one of my children, and now they were taking away another one, you understand. The foster family, Mrs. Shepherd. What was the name of the foster family that adopted John's brother? They were really very nice people. I met them, you know. In the beginning, I used to go and see my little boy. And then I got sick and I couldn't go any longer. Perhaps he thought I'd forgotten him. He must have thought I didn't love him anymore. His name, Mrs. Jeffrey. Please tell me the what name. Was his name? <laughs> but I loved him. Ooh. If you only knew how much I missed him. Poor, Please, poor old lady. His name. <clears throat> what was his name? Oh, my throat. Come closer. Uh. I would like to know. She looks like a ghoul from a uh, Fallout. No, I'm just gonna say. Just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Mm. How it took a very long time. 5.15 5 inches. Alright, we're in the red room. This is taking... This is going to be the longest walk ever. The last origami figure. The last trial. The last origami figure. The last trial. Okay, well I said that. Twice. <laughs> Oh, white. Ooh, bright. Oh, I can still walk. 
Ahem. Okay. The last trial. The last question. Are you prepared to give your life to save your sons? There is a deadly poison in this file. It will kill you in exactly 60 minutes. If you drink it, you will get the last letters of the address. You will have enough time to save your son and say goodbye to him, Damn. but then you will die. Damn. You can drink the file or decide to leave. That's... The choice is yours. That's a push. Save Sean. And die. And die. Christ. He loses his father, but at least he's alive. Maybe it's the right thing to do. Yep. Alright. Let's get it. Let's just get it over with. Down the hatch. No. No. Not down the hatch. You're just looking at it. Down the hatch. Theodore Roosevelt, Roosevelt Roosevelt Road. Okay. You didn't have to know. I did what I had to, Sean. Your dad's coming to save you. Oh boy. I don't want Ethan to die. God damn. That sucks. Jaden. It's Jaden. It's Jaden. Everybody say hi to Jaden. Noise, noise, noise. Sacrifice. Achievement unlocked. Trial master. Achievement unlocked. Actually, you know what, guys? I will end it right here because it is almost an hour long episode. So, uh, yeah, we did all that. Um, you know, it, I, I think the next episode will be the last episode of Heavy Rain. Um, yeah, I can't wait. You gotta see how get everything, um, how it ends, you know? Alright, well, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you want to watch, more if you want to uh su subscribe go ahead if you want to uh comment down below of any games you want me to play i will be happy to do so uh yeah thank you for watching and bye